Hello guys, welcome back to So That's Gaming and another PlayStation 3 video. Uh, we're going to be uh, showing you how to like use React PSN. Now, I'm sure this might be considered an outdated method of doing things uh, with the thanks of PS3 exploit version 3.0. But... Uh, I didn't need to use PS3 exploit version 3.0, so I do it this way. Now, what React PSN does is when you download your package files from, like, let's say, no PlayStation browser, uh, no, no PlayStation.com's browser, you'll get two things. You'll get a package file, a PKG file, and a wrap, RAP file. So all these were pkg files so i'm going to demonstrate to you what react psn does first things first i went ahead and downloaded a small game and we're going to go to the play the package installer and we're going to install package files from our storage device here the boy and his blob so depending on, like it's done in the past depending on how big the game is in this case one and a half gigs will determine about how long it takes to actually install. So we'll allow this to go ahead and install and we'll pick up in just a moment. All right, we're just about done here installing a boy and his blob. Now, I'm, after this gets installing, I'm going to demonstrate what happens if you try to run the game before you get done installing the wrap file. Now, with a PS3 exploit 3.0, um, it's for people who can't install custom firmwares. Where it, I don't know what use it has on with people that have custom firmware already installed on their system, but they use a RIF uh, file, and I don't know much about it. So, let's see all the way down here at the bottom. A boy and his blob. So, if we try running this. You're going to be presented with this error. This content can be used. It will be can be used if you renew your license at the PlayStation Store. Well, we don't want to do that because we went through all the trouble of downloading it. So, we have this program called React PSN, which looks like this. We're not going to run it here. So, what you're going to do, you're going to create a new user. Okay, you're going to call it AA. I don't know if it can be anything else, but for the sake of this video and argument, it has to be called AA. So you're going to go ahead and sign into AA, and then you'll run React PSN. Now, the first time you do this, it's going to go ahead and delete that user account, and it'll be and it'll be, it'll change to React PSN. This is where it'll be. Now, I don't think okay. Since I've already run this before, I'm not going to go through it all over again. So here, did I, am I signed in? Okay, that one signed in. Now if I run React PSN, it's going to find my wrap files on my USB drive, which go into the X data or X, yeah, X data folder on the USB drive. <clears throat> and it's going to go ahead and install those onto the system so that it can play those games. Once it comes back, here you are, you're all rebooted. I'm gonna turn that out, I wanna hear some music. All right, we're gonna log back into our regular account. Oh, I'm gonna turn up, right, 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 right. we're gonna log back into our, my regular account here. And we are gonna go in, now that we ran React PSN from its account, not your main account, we're going to go down and we're going to try running a boy and his blob again. Now those wrap files should be installed and it should run the way it's supposed to run. I guess it takes it just, there it goes. So there you go. So PKG file install. It's going back. We're going to go back and review real quick. We're going to quit that game. Yeah, I want to quit the game. Okay, so, come on. You can do it. <laughs> All right. So, first time you do everything. You're going to install. 
uh, from the, I, in the link to, in the description, I've included a link to React PSN. You'll install that package file. We we're not going to mess with. You won't mess with it just yet. You'll install all your P uh, PKG games that you've downloaded from uh, No Pay Station, for example, and you will install them all. And you'll try to run them. You'll notice that they won't work. After you got your PKG files installed and you've installed React PSN, you're going to create a new user, call it AA, switch to that account, and then you'll go back over to your game full uh, menu and you'll go back to React PSN. It will find your RAP files that are in your X data fo uh, folder on your USB drive which needs to be plugged into your rightmost port on your PlayStation. You'll run that, it'll locate those, it will install those, it will delete the AA account and leave this one. Then you can run, go back to your primary account and your installed game will work. To, if you wanna do it all over again, if you install more PKGs later on, you gotta install the RAP files, you'll just switch to the React PSN account and run React PSN. You'll find the rat files and install them per usual. So there you go, guys. If you guys have any questions, be sure to leave them in the comment section below. Uh, let me know that you and let me know if you like this video by smacking that like button, that little thumb up icon, and uh, let me know what you guys are looking forward to in the comment section below in the future. And if you haven't already done so, be sure to click that subscribe button. Get subscribed and keep coming back for more console and gaming videos here on So That's Gaming. Thanks again for watching. We'll see you next time. Peace.